Welcome back. This is Dan Havey with CF Ninja Hacks. And in this video, we are going to finish up the membership site training by talking about how to restrict access to your page in order to keep people from being able to see content that they haven't paid for or that you haven't authorized them to see. And yes, I don't know which way I have to go here. There is a cat sitting behind me. So um, yeah, he's, he's fine back there. Um, so the first thing I want to show you is how easy it is to get into one of these membership sites if you, even if you don't have the secret sign-up URL. It's a very simple hack. Everybody and their brother knows about it. So I'm not going to show you exactly how to do it. I'm going to walk through it, then I'm going to blank it out, but you'll get the idea at the end of why you want to restrict your content. So I'm going to come in here. And I'm going to do a few things, and you can just watch on the screen, even though, like I said, it's going to be blanked out. And I'm going to come down, and I'm going to click on something here that you're not going to be able to see. And look what happened. It just opened up. It just opened up the part up here where I can create a new account and log in. And if everything wasn't restricted, I'd be able to have access to absolutely everything. And it seriously took me, I think that was three clicks, in order to break in here. So like I said earlier, what I do is I put a link at the bottom down here that says, not, not all, you know, here it says already a member log in. I say, not a member, join here. And when they click on it, it opens up this this window up here and then they can just join and I know that I'm safe because I have everything set up regarding the restrictions. So as you recall, when we built out this funnel, we created a free membership and then we also created a premium membership with a product in the premium membership. So let's just say that this first section here, let's just rename this. Let's say this is going to be our free We'll just leave the rest there. So that's going to be our free section at the top. And so we're not going to set any restrictions at all. The restrictions get set down here. So we're going to leave that completely unset. And then we're going to go into our second section. And the same with the third and the fourth section, of course. But any section that you want restricted, you just simply come over. You click on Restrict Access. And in this case here, product requirement, we had our product, which for our CF Ninja Hacks demo membership funnel, we had our premium membership. So we just simply set that to our premium membership. You might have three or four or five different products that all have access to this one section because you could be selling tiered access. And so let's say section one was free and then section two, that could be for, let's say, three different levels of access, and then section three would be for two levels of access, and then section four would only be for the top, top level, and so that would only have one product in this blank for level of access, and that, of course, would be your highest paid content there, because number four, of course, whoever had access to four would also have access to three and two and one. Now, another thing you can do is you can put a tag in here. So let's say you add somebody to a list, and as part of being added to a list, you also give them a tag. That tag will also give them access to this page, or to this section, I should say. So let's just call this here our free tag. And so if somebody has a free tag, then they will be able to come in here or has the tag of free tag to be more accurate. They'll be able to come in here and they'll get access then to section number two. Now, in the event that somebody comes to the uh, comes to your page, and, and in fact, let me just show you that real quick here. And I do have one other thing I have to show you as well. All right, so here's, here's a site that we run for campaign managers. And if you come in here, you can see what happens is this is now restricted because of what we're working on doing right now. This section becomes restricted. So when this becomes restricted, you can have a link here that says upgrade here. When they click on that, they're going to go to a sales page. So when you're in here, when you set your sales page, this is where you want them to go. And in our case here, we'll scroll down a little bit and we got our funnel and we want them to upgrade to premium, which is the page over here that we created when we 
set up our funnel. And so that's where we want them to go when they buy or when, when they want to upgrade. So again, if they came in and they were in on the free access for just section number one, when they come down and they highlight over any of the sections below it, there's going to be a, a there's going to be a link here where if they click on that, they can go to the page where there's going to be a sales letter, order form, whatever you want there, and then they can upgrade there. So they can come here, click on that, and they can upgrade to premium. And so we will update the lesson section. Now, depending on when you start building out your membership funnel, they may or may not have put out the Wasabi upgrade. If not, what you can do is come into, into your account, over to your face, account details, and you'll come onto this page, and you just scroll down to the bottom, and you will turn on what is known as the Wasabi Membership OTO. Just click that button and turn on that functionality. What that will do is that will then open up this part down here at the bottom where again we are now in section three so let's say again they have to have the premium membership and then if they don't have that then we want them to go to the order form page for the upgrade to premium and we will click on update the lesson and that's all you have to do in order to protect this so again you want to come in you want to turn on the Wasabi upgrade, and then fill out the form like we just did, fill out everything. Again, we'll do it very quickly here. Premium membership. If they haven't bought yet, upgrade to premium, update the lesson section, and that is it. Now these three sections not down here, not only are they protected, but they also have a link so that somebody can upgrade just by clicking on that link. So if again, we go back into this existing membership, you see all of them here. And again, what you're going to see is here are the weeks. And for each week, we only have one lesson for each one of the weekly sections. So now let's take a look at what, what all this looks like when we go inside of the membership area. So what we have to do is we have to come in and create a totally new account. So I will create a new account. And because I created a brand new account, I mean, we can even pretend I hacked into this site. What's going to happen is absolutely nothing. Why is this not working? What did I do wrong? And here's something that you're going to run into a lot when dealing with membership sites. And I usually forget it. And then I scratch my head for a minute. And then I remember what the problem is. And the problem is, is you're always kind of logged into your membership site. Even, even if you come in with a different email address, you're still kind of logged in because it's your site. And so in order to get this to work, I had to open up an incognito window. And then I had to put in the URL to get back in I, and I log back in and now it's working properly. So now what happens when you come in and you hover over these sections, what you're going to see is again is access restricted and then it's going to say upgrade here. But if they're not open, of course, they don't show. But what's really nice here, and this is a new thing coming with this Wasabi upgrade, is you can still see what's in all of these lessons. You can still see all the lessons that are within the sections. And so you know what you're going to get when you click on the upgrade button. And so then you come in and you click on upgrade here. And then it should take us back. Great, it does. It takes us back to the order form page. So when I couldn't get it to work at first, I went in and I clicked on the contact that I just created. And here's something new inside of the contact um, area itself. And um, like I said, this is the first time I've seen it. So it's, what it's showing here is that contact has access to section number one, which was the free section. But if you see down here, they don't have access to any of the other sections. So again, this is a nice, another nice little part that they're putting in as they're starting to roll out the Wasabi upgrades for the membership areas. So that's it for today. If you want to make sure that nobody can get into your stuff and steal your content or have people look at it that haven't paid, then definitely um, do the Wasabi OTO on here and protect all the content and then as well have a link for them to be able to go and buy the product from you. 
So that is it for our membership training. I hope it was helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me and have a great day.